Hi guys, welcome back, back to my humble abode. Um, if you watched my last video about my tour review, it was in here, I've done the washing up this time, so that's fine. Uh, I entered the competition on Instagram uh, with Mid Kent Tools and Fixings, and on they did on their Instagram was, it was a thousand pound bundle. So uh, Bosch, DeWalt, Makita, um, and Milwaukee, or a thousand pounds worth of hand tools out of their, um, their catalog. So I entered it, Joe's one number, 20 pound, thought nothing about it. And I always moan people say, oh, I never win anything, but I barely ever enter anything. So if you don't enter, you haven't got a chance of winning. But I won, I won. So what I chose, he messaged me. Unfortunately, I actually never read the competition properly. I was at work when I, I, I sort of entered the lottery, should we say, didn't read it properly. So when I won, he was like, all oh, right, that's brilliant, congratulations, well done, all this sort of stuff. Um, so I picked one thing and he said, no, no, let's pick four other things, read it again. And it was actually, I thought it was one power tool, three batteries, a charger and a bag. I went for Bosch because I've got Bosch stuff. And uh, he must be saying pick four things, four more things. So I actually picked five Bosch power tools, three batteries. I mean, my first plan was, do I get stuff for Adam? A thousand pounds worth of stuff for Adam, even though I've just bought him a, a, a drill. But thinking about it, and I did a good an hour talking to my other half about it and whatnot. I thought, well, over the next, two to three year period, he's not gonna use barely any of these tools. I won't let him leave them in my van, just in case, worst case scenario, gets broken into again, or my van gets stolen. All of his tools go as well. And he doesn't really wanna be lugging his that many power tools, because sometimes he gets the bus and I meet him somewhere, or I pick him up from college, that sort of stuff. So I said, right, no, I'll get Bosch stuff. Obviously, I've got Bosch everything anyway. Bear with me. Sorry about that. Obviously, very professional of me. Uh, I'm recording at home, and just fed the kids and my like the last video, my daughter won't leave me alone, which is, she's lovely, bless her, but uh, no peace and quiet, but hey ho, you guys just have to deal with it, same as I am. Uh, she's just now signed the corner, eating a box of Maltesers. Say hi. Oh, thank you. Mm. So, can't remember that. So yeah, all of that, the reason I didn't get Adam's stuff is purely the fact that in the next two, three years, he isn't gonna be able to use it. And right now, if I get the Bosch stuff, I'll have duplicates of some of my tools, he can then have his own stuff in my van, that's mine. So if it gets lost or broken, it's not an issue. So here it is. Turned up today. Uh, it was posted on Friday. Turned up. And I do want to say a massive thank out to um, Mid Kent Tools and Supplies because this is awesome. This is awesome. So I've never done an unboxing video. I've seen other people do them. I give it a shot. So I'm going to sit you right here. Let me just make sure you can see this one in the corner. Right. 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 Ooh. Okay, by the looks of things, I've already opened it upside down. So, that's a good start. What's first on the list? So, first of all, what have we got? So, can I have another one, please? Thank you. So, first of all, you've got the impact and the combi. And the catalogs. I'm going to get chucked away. Oh dear. There you go. So, this is actually a new and improved impact. Just got a funny end to it. So, New uh, light front battery indicator also on the drill. Or is that the power setting? Oh, it is. Torque setting. Brushless as well. Nice five amp battery. Very nice, very nice. New version there, brushless combi. I th think, 
Yeah, this is the 13 mil chuck. Um, bit of a variation from mine. It's got the smart um, chip that you can put in it to Bluetooth to your phone. So if you get the app on your phone, it sort of gives diagnostic of how your drill's doing, if it kicks back and that sort of stuff. Um, a little bit more compact than my one. Uh, still got the metal chuck on the end, so very nice, very nice. And then the uh, very nice and uh, the new version of the quick charger, um, which is quite different in looks to my other ones. Nice, nice. And then it's got your hooks for your tool, uh, for your belt to clip onto, leave one battery out. And it's a new version of the L box as well, which is slightly different, a bit more curved on the edges. Next, what we got next? So, the looks of things. Yes, let's have opened it upside down. So that's the insert tray for your L box. It's okay. Too many more teasers. You all right? No, we're okay, no casualties. Another five amp battery. And this is the insert for the cordless jigsaw. I've got a Bosch jigsaw, but it's a corded one. So I thought, fancy the, fancy the cordless version. And this will come in handy, especially when I'm doing fuse boards. So the one back box I cut out of the back, obviously when I do rear entry, excuse me, um, then this will come in perfect for, for doing the cuts and whatnot. Saves using the multi-tool and setting everything on fire as usual. So nice, but not too heavy, nice flat. So yeah, that's that one. Let's figure out how this goes either. That's that one. Loads of back in. There you go. Oh, we're taking the seats apart now, are we? Do you want to play with that? Oh dear. Oh dear. Next on the list, which I've always wanted, but at the same time, I have never thought I need one that much to go out and spend the money on it. But now I have the choice to get one for free, I'm going for it. So it's the uh, 18 volt uh, reciprocating saw. It's a big piece of kit as well. Hang on. It's a beast. So I've, known, I've worked with a few plumbers and they've got the Makita version, I think it is, of one of these, and they find it great for a few floorboards, joists, all that sort of stuff. I've got battery in it. I just, I'm genuinely really, really, really looking forward to playing with that at work. Uh, it's come with a few blades. Oh no, that's the jigsaw blades. And the jigsaw books. This is an SDS, Bosch SDS attachment bit. So obviously it goes in your, whatever SDS you've got and you can put spade bits in that, probably, you know, put a screwdriver bit in it um, for cutting joists. So I have got one of them, but it's a, a cheap one I bought years ago off eBay that did actually break, I think last year. So that's a handy bit of kit. I'll come back to you shortly. I can't see any blades in there, but I need to dig to the bottom. So jigsaw blades, put you down. Oh, there we go. I'm stupid. So I'm not going to put them in now because I don't want them anywhere near the kids, to be honest. I know what they're like. Uh, right, let's pop that down there. Next on the list. So what we've got is an 18 volt mini SDS. I've got two 36 volt SDSs and I know Dan recently has upgraded. And I think uh, Thomas uh, Nagy got the smaller versions of these. I think uh, Tom does use these ones. Um, because my one is as big and as strong as I think I am. After you know a couple of holes where your arms full length, I'm pointing this at me. Arms full length, it really does knock you out because they are bloody heavy. Um, so this, especially for taking up ladders and uh, you know even steps or just stuff high up, it's you don't need a lot of kick for some bricks, and you, don't, you need so sometimes you need a lot of weight behind them. But this should be perfect, especially with 18 volts. So yeah, ace. Good one. So obviously you've got your normal screw function or your hammer drill because you don't, wouldn't just have a hammer drill, yeah. You wouldn't just have a, a normal hammer function on it because there's, there's not enough kick in it. But this is this is perfect. And obviously it comes with a attachment as well to hold it. So 
Yeah, it's wicked. Uh, next on the list, more packaging. Now, last thing is a new Bosch bag. I mean, you lot have probably seen from my Bosch bag that what I normally do is when I get to work, me and Adam fill the one Bosch bag we've got, and that's our sort of power tool carrying bag. And I've had that quite a few years now, and uh, this one's nice and fresh. So, whether or not I say to Adam, you have this one, or if you want to bring in your set of power tools of this lot, then you have the, the new one, and I'll have the old one. And, you know, it's always depending how many uh, how many uh, power tools you need on a certain job. And last but not least, the Bosch cleaning cloth, which I actually think I still own the original one I bought from one of my first drills. Not that I ever used it; it's just been sat in the van. Oh, and that's it. We're all we're all done. To be honest, I think amazing, absolutely chuffed. So uh, yeah, I'll spread this out. So we've got the bag, we've got the jigsaw. We've got the SDS. I'm super saying hating saw. And then it's not bad for 20 quid, was it? And also I will show off I bought this uh, this the other day. Actually I bought it at Elex show, but it's only just uh, only just turned up. Let me open this up for you guys. So it's the uh, the Mega Earth uh, clamp meter, earth leakage clamp meter. And I have used it twice so far. I did a video the other day of uh, fault finding and I didn't have this, it turned up the day after I did it and I returned back the next day to start doing it. But the video was, I might still put it on. I couldn't find the fault. I think it was an appliance. It was one of them, I had weird test readings. They had USB socket outlets everywhere and it had been nailing it down in the rain. So it was a bit of everything, but um, yeah, I'll still, I'll still see if I can come back to this. If I, can, if I nip back to that job with this, test things properly, uh, I say properly, you know what I mean, really go around, I was on a bit of a, of a tight schedule with the jobs, but uh, anyway, once again, mid Kent tools and fixings, superstars, I'll, uh, I'll put the link in below, for the description, sorry, I'll put the description below, uh, their Instagram, their website, give them a follow, give them a like, they normally do this every now and then, sort of a tall lottery, if not, they're always doing competitions, and as you can see, it's always, it's always worth a look. Lastly, I just want to say an absolute massive thank you to everyone that watches the videos. It helps me do this and, uh, and record for you guys and spend obviously my time at work recording stuff. And I, I really do enjoy it. So if you do like the videos, please, please do subscribe. Say subscribe. <laughs> no. You gay. Okay, there you heard it first. She said, okay, you need to subscribe. So it's out. All right. Cheers, guys.